Amazing day here in L.A. to continue this playoff series. Mike Rizzo, kind enough to join a few moments with us. Mike, unbelievable setting. And from the standpoint of your ball club, a whole change in mindset. Is, hasn't it been over the last 24 hours now? Well, it is. You know, it, you finally get the monkey off your back. You win a home playoff game against a really good team like the Dodgers against, uh, you know, Hill, who's an accomplished uh, starting pitcher. So we feel good about ourselves. It's, you know, you got to come in here and, and uh, play a, a really clean game of baseball to walk out of here. And, uh, and we're looking we're looking forward to getting back to D.C. and our home, uh, the home stadium, and uh, and you know moving on from this round. Going back to Sunday's game just a little bit, a real team effort for the ball club. Everybody contributing, and uh, the bullpen again, great. The bullpen thing has to please you from games one and two, doesn't it? Yeah, well, they've been solid for us all year. Uh, you know, it's a couple of the acquisitions really fit in nicely uh, there at the trade deadline and, and after the trade deadline. Uh, so we we like where the bullpen's at. Uh, you know, this is playoff baseball, so they you know. Know, they're they're called upon you know each and every day they have to be ready and uh, and they've really performed well and uh, you know th you know today will be no different we'll uh, we'll have to see where uh, where things are at and uh, and hopefully they come up with another performance for us big day for Gio big day for the ball club what are you hoping for for him today well yeah just to do what he does against the Dodgers uh, you know he's pitched well in this ballpark he's pitched well uh, you know against the Dodgers and uh, and he's a quality left-handed starter so uh, he needs to be himself on the strike zone be aggressive work for a quick tempo and a, and a quick pace and, and really be aggressive uh, early on in the game and uh, and uh, just utilize utilize the stuff he has trust the stuff he has and, and, and throw a lot of strikes one thing that really sticks out to me from the first couple of games at home especially games Game one were the contributions from all the young guys and I know we hear a lot about players getting rushed to the big leagues these days it appears to me when you see Severino and Defoe and obviously Trey Turner and the other guys they were ready for big league level baseball your thoughts on those kids coming out of the two games at home well you know it's uh, you know me it's all about scouting and player development these guys they're, they're scouted and we select them we bring them into our minor league system and they're prepared to, for, to play in the big leagues the day they get here and uh, you know we threw these guys in the deep end of the pool these young rookie players who didn't have don't have a lot of experience under the belt we're throwing them in the biggest you know environment that you could be in and uh, and uh, you know the one thing that we we can say and I can honestly say about them they're not afraid they're not intimidated they're not scared and uh, that's half the battle they, they believe that they belong here and uh, and a lot of them are embracing the uh, the big stage I have to ask you about Daniel Murphy the guy looks like he had a couple of days off not a couple of weeks off your observations on what he's been able to do so far well you know to you know first of all to, to get him on the field he works extremely hard uh, you know after uh, after he had the uh, the glute thing uh, to but to, to get him and the prep the preparation that he makes and the, uh, the the just the way that he gets on the field is remarkable uh, you know he falls out of bed and can hit and and uh, you know his simple approach his preparation and the work that he does before before the games, before he gets in the batter's box, is, is amazing, uh, and, and it makes him the hitter that he is. Uh, you know, and he's got God-given, uh, you know, bat-to-ball skills, and a guy that's not intimidated by, by any pitcher, and, and 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 you know, a person that can move the ball around and put the barrel on the bat. Uh, he has the he has the, the uh, gives us an opportunity to, to have a good at bat every time. Mike, thanks so much for your time, and all the best today. My pleasure. Thanks, guys.